Hi guys, Liz Pet here coming at you with my February empties and let's get started. The first item is the Pond's Wet Cleansing Palette. I got this in the Walmart Beauty Box and I did not really care for it. There's only five palettes. I probably used three or four on my face and then the rest just to clean up swatches. I just wasn't a big fan. The next are three of those sheet masks. There was one in rose. Uh, green tea and aloe. This is by Bio Miracle. I just picked these up at Marshalls. Uh, they're nice and pampering. I think I have two more in the box. And then I'm going to try a different brand uh, after I've finished up the box of these. They do make my skin look nice and feel nice. I'm not sure what long lasting benefit I'm getting, but I do enjoy them for spa treatment. The next item you guys have seen before. Studio 35 Daily Moisturizing Lotion with Natural Colonial Oatmeal. This is the Walmart version of Aveeno, and I really enjoy it. And I actually have the large size now, and it's very, very reasonably priced. The next item I have is the is the backward item, the Derma E microdermabrasion scrub. I really enjoyed this product. I am going to purchase more of it. It got rid of those like little white balls on your face. Like I don't know if it's makeup or what, but sometimes you'll get little white Mila. Now I heard that uh, from Pretty Piss 86 who said she had heard that it gets rid of it around your eyes. Like if you wear too much uh, serum, eye serum, uh, I actually never put it that close to my eyes to find out, so I am going to buy another jar and, you know, put it there and find out. This, the Olay Regenerous Regenerating Serum Fragrance Free. I love this stuff. It's probably the most effective um, wrinkle reducer item uh, in my arsenal. And when I was at Ulta picking up stuff for my uh, 100 subscriber giveaway, which, by the way, thanks, guys. I really appreciate that. But I was at Ulta, and I, I did already pick up another one of those. The last uh, situation here, I've got a few items. This is the L'Oreal Mousse Absolute. It's the conditioner that comes with the uh, hair dye. I used it. I didn't feel it was the one where uh, it's in separate tubes in one container and so you can reuse it, but it seemed like it washed out of my hair is what I felt. I was, you know, it's nice so you can just do your roots and still have some more for next time, but I don't think the staying power was there. Uh, the next one I have is the Natural Instincts Color Treat. Uh, I've had this for quite a few months, so uh, I finally used it up as a hair mask because I'm out of hair mask, so I just put it on and put a shower cap on, and I have actually gone back to uh, Natural Instincts. I do enjoy that, but because I'm a get-on-sale person, I had purchased, this is what I have in my hair now, the Revlon Color Silk, and this is in the color medium golden brown. Now, my hair is very dark brown. It is not black, but it is very dark brown. If I put black in it, you can tell the difference. But if I put brown, medium dark brown, medium brown, uh, any shade within, well, actually blonde. It doesn't matter what you put on my hair. It generally stays dark brown, but the reason I choose different colors uh, every time I, I color my hair, I choose like a different color brown because the only thing that actually colors is my is my roots and the uh, natural platinum blonde highlights I'm getting in the temple area. And so the different colors in that area, my platinum blonde area, uh, kind of gives my hair some depth. So it, my hair is always dark brown. By the time you get out of the root area, it's always the same color. So I just uh, range between different browns every time I color my hair. 
But this is the first time I've tried this Revlon Color Soak, and I am loving this. I am loving this stuff. I don't think it's very expensive either, but I, I got this on sale. The difference is this one comes with one packet of conditioner, and whereas the uh, Preference and the Natural Instinct, uh, it they come with tubes that you can reuse. So that's it for my empties. Uh, thanks for talking with me, guys. Uh, watch, I'll be putting my giveaway video up pretty soon, and I'll talk with you later.